Don't use universal cues as a bad take and bad advice. Cues are just verbal commands that assist with the performance in a task. Cues are intended to direct an individual to more efficient movement. Universal cues are universal for a reason, because they often work. You may hear someone say that you shouldn't cue someone to jump in a clean or a snatch because you don't actually jump when you do those things, but that's misguided. Cues don't have to be taken literally. I just recently posted a video about cueing someone not to pull the bar above your belly button. That obviously doesn't mean to not propel the bar high during the second pull. It's just a good cue for someone who has an overactive arm pull. It's an appropriate cue for some and an inappropriate cue for some. Don't make things harder on yourself by thinking you shouldn't use a certain cue because the cue isn't accurately describing what the movement is actually doing. I've seen plenty of other coaches that I've worked with in the past refuse to use simple effective cues. Cues that would provide instantaneous improvements simply because the cue isn't actually correct. The jump cue while teaching the Olympic lifts is a perfect example of this. The knees out cue when teaching someone how to squat is another perfect example of this. Hump the bar cue when teaching the Olympic lifts is another Another example of this. There are honestly way too many to name. Anyways, it's just a short video with a short rant. I think this is underrated and valuable advice for anyone who's just getting started into coaching who hears this nonsense. Figuring out which cues are appropriate for which individuals is the art of coaching. I don't care if it's considered a universal cue or not, or if the cue is accurately describing the movement or not. If the cue works in assisting a better movement for the individual, it's a good cue. So thanks for watching the video. I'll see you next time.